Good morning guys, welcome to camping week, camping with our horses. I'm so excited for all the um, for all the experiences we're gonna get to have this week. Um, we're starting first at the barn, we're picking up our horses, we also have our lessons, we also have the chiropractor coming to see Storm. Oh, I think I'm riding Stella today because no, Spencer's not getting chiropracted. Anyway, girls are going down to get the horses. Let's get this day started. I'm so okay. excited. Are you guys excited? Because I have to yeah. pack up Stella too. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah, they're still stunned because I woke up so grouchy. <laughs> The weather is amazing, you guys. It's it's not humid. It's just it's a little bit humid, but it's just nice. It's a bit rainy. It's been raining. If the weather stays like this till we get where we're going, it'll be amazing because I don't want our horses to bake. While the girls go get the horses, I will get packed up because we have to pack up still. We didn't even pack up any of our horse stuff. So you thought you got it made for. All right, so we have a tack trunk, but it's filled with all of our stuff for shows, and I don't want to uh, unpack it for shows and then pack it again. So I'm going to bring this tote and possibly that blue one over there. I'm trying to fit everything we need for our trip in here. Uh, Sophie wants to bring these three saddle pads, and they're all the light ones. I kind of wanted her to bring the dark ones because they won't get as dirty, but whatever, it's just a saddle pad, right? And they wash. Um, and I want her to bring the purple one for Stella, and she said she can't wear it. She can't use the purple saddle pad ever again because it's, it's, it's Sabrina's. Like, how do you use something that you loved and that you bought for somebody else, and you loved her so much? You can't just give it to somebody else. It's, I don't know, our instructor thinks we're stupid, but I don't know, it's just hard. Like, there's no way we can use it. This is happening. Look at our new sticker. Get back in that window. Get in there. Get in there. Ruby's gonna hop right out that window. Get, get back in there. Get in there. <laughs> uh, we brought all of our dogs with us because it's kind of that kind of family. We can't go anywhere and that's why we picked our this vacation so we could bring all of our pets with us. And that mean and I mean that literally since we're taking the horses. Stay. Are we closing the gate? All right, you guys. We're ready. We're ready. Almost. Oh, they're excited for the hay. Stella seems a little aggressive in there. Goodbye, Molly. See you later. Keep it open until we go. Okay, so there's a, we're not taking 401, right? Because there's a crash. Bye, wish us luck, wish you were coming. Goodbye, Molly. We are loaded up. We All right, we are on our way. Got the horses back there. I'm gonna show you guys, we left all the doors open. I'm just a bit nervous about it. Our instructor told me not to do it, but he left them all open. We stopped, I made Sam close the windows. I'm like, we cannot ride with the windows open. Let me see. Uh-oh. Ruby. Oh, I left my door open? Yeah, well that's Ruby. Just wanted to make sure you guys are okay. We've only been driving five minutes. They're all good. I think we need more hay. We need to fill it up, man. Oh, yeah. We're all starving because we had to run out early this morning. And so clearly, clearly, we are getting McDonald's. But when Sam bought the trailer, the guy said that he drove all the way to Florida. All the way to Florida. Macy wants to be in the video. Right, Macy? Um, he said he drove all the way to Florida with the windows open, so it would be fine. So Sam got that in his head and didn't listen to me. But then finally I said, Sam, we're not driving with the windows open. It's just too nerve wracking. They could, anything could fly in. And he said, fine. And we stopped at McDonald's and he closed the windows. Somebody's happy to be going on vacation. Right, Macy, right. driving for about an hour and we want to make sure that the horses are okay and we're gonna give them a drink because they haven't had a drink for a while and we want to make
make sure that they have enough hay. Uh, we're, the girls and I are going to go to the bathroom and we're going to let them have some air. I'm just checking on the phone. Oh, Estella looks mad. Oh. Yeah, they ate that hay. They're empty. <laughs> that trailer and go. Wow, that's where all the hay went. Look at it. There's hay everywhere. Yeah, he knocked it half on the ground. So we brought water with us. We brought ice to kind of cool it down. Look, he wants a drink. He wants a drink. Storm's really chill. He's like, they both pooed? That's okay. That's because they're eating. Stella's still eating. She's like, this is the best trip. <laughs> I think as long as we, she's not normally food motivated, but remember, she's on a diet. Yeah. Watch out. You gotta eat only all of the food. Yeah. Aw, Stormy. People are asking what are these um, bumpers for? The bumpers are the hats? Drink. Oh, yes. Oh, thank you, he says. See how much we love you? It's actually not too hot in here either. Yeah, I got those windows open. Yeah, I got the vents. Please don't spit on me! Good boy! He's all confused. He's like, I don't know what's happening. Going on the trip. On the secret Stella. Trip. I know, Water I was thinking that one. Is she drinking? Yeah. Yeah, she's having a big drink too. Like, wow, you guys are awesome. I gotta be in the stall. So wow, yeah. she's really drinking. So thirsty. All right, let's go to the bathroom, girls, and we'll let Dad fill up their hay. <laughs> Open up the doors for our. And open them up. How about the sides? Are they open? Yeah. So they locked? Can I take out? Yeah. Locked? They're locked. Oh, both of them locked? I did them both. All right, let's go. You lift it up and just stick it in there like that. Yep, yeah. push and then put, put down. No, you're pushing too much. There we go. We're good. Now we'll just wait. Now we'll just wait and see. Oh, hey, how you doing, Storm? Yes, yes. You want to get out. I know. I know you guys want to get out. Soon. You won't believe what happened. The dogs locked their truck. And luckily, I was going to freak out and Sophie say, why do you have your window open? Because the air conditioning's on. But luckily, I didn't freak out on her because the dogs locked the door. <laughs> The air is on and the dogs lock the door. All right, this is Stella's home for the next couple of days. Lots of trees, not too sunny. Wait, lock me and lock me and I'm Stella. A little muddy. And then Storm is right next door here. Yeah, so this is Storm, Storm's home. It's the, these ones are a little muddy though. But um, there's one we can put them in too that's drier. Yeah, but it's in the sun and it's really hot over there and it's cooler. Yeah, it's cooler over here. Yeah. If there is something we need, it's a leap of faith. Step away from the comfort zone and be a little brave So take a look around you, how far can you see? How far do you think you can run, standing on your knees? It's a beautiful
beautiful world out there and just don't pass on the dare if you have the will and a moment to spare it's a beautiful world out there. right Stella you gotta take off her helmet and then rope halter Leave it like that, just put the rope, take the rope halter. I don't like that they're not right beside each other though. Oh, they hate each other. Get tight. Oh, she sees the grass. Ooh. Not too much grass. I like that it's not a left foot. Okay, go and uh... So I'm up. It's probably because of the water I didn't uh... okay. We find out Stella can jump <laughs> when we leave her here. She's like, I'm not staying there. It's a beautiful world out there. It can be a bit frightening. It's something you don't know. You need a little enlightening. Uh, look how fast he's going. No, 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 no. Look, there's. Water. Oh boy. He's kind of drank right up. It'll make you go. It's a beautiful world out there. Just don't pass on the dead. If you have the will and a moment to spare, it's a beautiful world out there. It's a beautiful world. Hello. You see Stella there? Stella's right here, you guys. Right next door. They are exploring the fact that there's a little bit of grass. grass. I mean, essentially they said that we could put both of them in one in one corral. That's what you're meant to. This is slippery. Um, but because it's not completely filled today, we got an extra corral. So if worse comes to worse and they argue, uh, look, look at, at him. him. Stella! <laughs> he, he's like, Stella! Where am I? They're freaked out. It's like, help, Mama. Aww. <laughs> help, Mama. He comes right over to Gabby. Help. <laughs> yeah, we'll get some fly spray. Okay, go on. Oh, so slippery. Yeah. Was it was slippery for him. He's like, take me with you. Don't leave me here. He's like strange horses. What's this? Okay, we should switch them because she's got more grass. No Look way. at you guys, Gabby brushed your hair. <laughs> it's all sweaty and gross now. Apparently oh it rained last night, so that's why there's so much mud. Another horse called, so. I don't know, Stella, the girls seem to. Like, what do I do, Stella? Girls seem to settle better. Yeah, Stella does. Stella's relaxed. Yeah, she's relaxed over she's there. Checking out her surroundings. And Storm's like, help me, come back to me, Stella. <laughs> Storm! Come here, bud. He's eyeballing the grass over there. Aw, they want to be together. There's another pen that we can put them in that we're going this to once it gets a little big. Once it gets a little uh less Hi. sunny out. Hi. Before we show you a tour of our um, our, our vacation Trailer. home for the weekend Trailer. or for the next couple of days, I have to tell you this quick story. No. So basically, I got Stella here too. So basically, I did so good in my lesson today. Like, I wait till you guys see. I'm not going to give away any secrets, but a whole English. lot of... Cantering. Stop. No, it involves cantering. A whole lot of changes happening in my lesson this week. But anyway, um... I got so brave after I'm like I'm the girls weren't there I was like I'm just gonna take him for a trail ride and so we start going for a trail ride and he's like I'm going down to the barn I said no we're going this way he said no I'm not going this way I said yes we are going this way he said fine I spy some grass over there and I'm gonna eat it and I said no you're not gonna eat it and he said yeah let's go I'm gonna eat it and I said no you're not gonna eat it and then he ate it and then I said stop it and he said okay fine but we're going my way and I was like okay fine we'll go your way so he got his way but yeah it was really funny actually um yeah how he got his way he is so smart like he knows how to make me unnerved enough to give him his way so what do you think I love Stella <laughs> what do you think I love Stella 
Right, so she's gonna have a drink. I wish we could push these together and put them together because Oh god, Storm, please don't spit on Like look at Storm. He's pacing. And I don't like his because it's all wet and muddy. This is like a little bit more dried out. They're not fitting together. They can't. Gabby's just worried that he'll be mean. Which I mean he lives in her stall in her paddock anyway. Right, so our power today is by generator. Um, so uh, this is our site and we have this dry ring here but it's just too sunny right now so eventually we'll move both of the horses over here so that we can put our chairs out here, sit on our chairs and watch our horses. Over there is all sorts of fun stuff. We'll get to you. Anyway, we got a picnic table here, some mats going up into the trailer. So you go up and inside it's really cute, huh? Small kind of, but cute, smells good. It's got a clock over there. Um, essentially, I think this pulls out and the girls will either, I think it's only just like a small bed, to be honest. So the girl, one girl will sleep there. One girl will sleep there. You got the kitchen and the stove. I'll show you the kitchen in a minute. Uh, this is our bed, my, mine and Sam's bedroom. We got all the drawers over there. This is our bed, closet, lots of storage. Um, over here to the kitchen. Essentially, I can see Stella out there. The sink, look at, they come with all this stuff. Like, it comes with all the stuff that you need for food, and not for food, you have to bring your own food. Wow, we should have brought wine, we don't drink. <laughs> we, ne we hardly ever drink, but imagine if we did. Look at, you have shot glasses, like, wow. This is kind of an adult vacation, maybe. Um, so further down here, it's got a coffee maker, a toaster, tablecloth, probably for the picnic table. Um, oh, a candle, look at that, so that you can get rid of the bugs. Fridge. Okay, um, so then further down here, oh, that's what the girls have. All right, this is better. Welcome to your bunks. The girls have not seen this. And, and they can look outside and see their horses. See Stella? Oh, I didn't even see this here. Okay. So uh, that's Sophie's bed. That's Gabby's bed. They're gonna be shocked. Oh, here's all the pots and the pans. Right, here's all the pots and the pans that we need. I should have brought bacon. All the stuff, what's in here? Ironing, I don't know what that is. And then, dun, da, 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 in here is the bathroom. Yep, lots of toilet paper down there. So yeah, that is our trailer for the night. I'm gonna take some pictures and post it on Instagram. Here's our stove, our microwave, all the important things. I mean, this is a much newer trailer than our trailer. It's super cute. Super cute. All right, so while the girls get settled, basically hang out with their horses because they're just gonna wanna hang out with their horses as much as they can. Look at your bed, look at your bedroom. Oh. That's mine. Yeah, and look out, look out the window and see what Capability, you can see. Capability, 350. As long as you weigh less than 350 pounds, you're good. Oh, I weigh less. I'm used to tiny bathrooms. We are in the middle of the country, horse country. There's no cell service here, none. There's no electricity. There's no cell service and no electricity, which basically means we're on our own. Fiona said, message me if you have a problem. I'm like, don't worry, I will. I won't because I have no cell service. And we have a generator and it runs the air conditioning. Can you guys hear it? Anyway, it has to turn off at 11 p.m. I'm already scorched. What's gonna happen at 11 p.m.? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is such a shock. This is what it would be like if we had horses. Like, Gabby hasn't come in. They've been messing around with their horses like crazy. But here, I've got my drinks on the table. We got water. We got a horse brush. <laughs> Where do horse brushes go? Hey, 
I brought this in just to ask you if we can ride today. Do you think we should ride? Yeah. When's it like cool down? Like not trot or anything. Yeah, just just take them around, see what's going on. Yeah, just walk. Yeah. I think I want to see the cross country course and stuff. And yeah. Well, we I don't know what we're gonna do. We might. We're gonna go eat. We're gonna go someplace and eat because. Do you want to go someplace and eat? How come? Because it's too far of a drive. It's just when we came in. It's at the beginning of the resort. Well, it's gonna take a forever. No, like literally around the corner. Like so, we're still in the same resort. Well, it's just around the corner. There's a beach. For a second. No, we're gonna go and eat. I want to introduce you guys. I know it's gonna be a shock to you. I got a new uh, horse for the weekend. Just for the weekend. I'm gonna introduce you right now. Hope you can hear me. This is my new horse. Isn't she pretty? Isn't she beautiful? That's what I'll be riding on the trails with the girl if it comes to it. So we have our water buckets. This is Stella's. We won't be leaving for any length of time so we can fill it up all the time. You're doing great. Look, why didn't you put her hay over here where it's, where it's not sunny? But that's the only dry spot. There's this dry spot right in front of here. just hung his hay net up there. Oh, did you guys see that? You know who, look at who's shaking in fear. <laughs> She's literally shaking. Oh yeah, Ruby met Storm, and Storm was like, I'm a tough guy, ready to squeal at her. And Ruby touched his nose and went, Woo! And Ruby <laughs> ran back, and I was like, no! <laughs> so thirsty, I'm just glad. I brought electrolytes with me in case they didn't drink. Ruby, say hi to Stella. I'm hot, what do you want to do? You want to feed them and then go see what they have here? Yeah. All right, there's no cell service. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.